Hi besties, in this part of the video, I'm gonna show you how I ironed my napkins into a leaf. So I have the tag right here on my left side and I'm going to fold it into two triangles right here. And I wanna press on it just so I can have really nice creases. And then right here, I'm just going to flip it over and I'm going to be folding it in half right here. And I'm going to iron it again. I want to have a really nice crease. And then I'm going to fold it in half one more time and just crease it right here at the edge again. I'm going to fold it one more time right here and I just want it to be on the center of the triangle. Then I'm going to do the same on this other side and just iron it down right here. When that's all nice and creased, I'm going to flip it over to the side. And then right here, I'm going to practice folding it first before I press it down with the iron. I do recommend practicing folding before we press it down with the iron and on this last fold right here we want the pattern facing up so when we open up the napkin all we see is the pattern so once we have it all folded just how we want it we want to crease every fold individually so we can have a really nice crease on them and I have one two and three So on the other side, we are going to be doing the same thing. We're going to be folding it. And again, let's practice on this before we crease it down with the iron. So we're going to use the other side as our guide. So we just want to fold it. to be using this ribbon that came with the packaging with the napkins I just think the touch of gold is gonna look really nice so I'm just gonna tie a little bow on the back for the napkin to stand up on your plate we do want to push down on the bottom of the napkin so we're just gonna split it in half and push it down towards the plate and then we are just going to be fixing our napkin once you have it standing up mine did stay up so you should be good to go after that
I want to show you the first thing that I purchased at the thrift store. I found this beautiful table, you guys. I have been looking for a table with storage and I am so happy that I found it. This was $20. Look at how beautiful it is. I did have my son sand it down on the top already and <laughs> I couldn't wait. I had to start painting it. Um, I always start the projects without showing you guys what I'm doing so I had to stop really quick and record this before I kept on painting. just finished painting it i did give it four coats of the white paint and you guys i don't know what to do right here i was thinking of painting this part white but i don't think it would look nice so my sander will not work like to sand it down right here so if i want to paint if i want to stain it i'll probably have to do this by hand but that's just so much work so i don't know if i really want to do you that you guys once i finish um, staining it i am gonna take it outside just because this stain is really strong and i am gonna use this dark walnut and then i do have a um, pre-stained wood conditioner too and i'm thinking of doing something right here um if i do i'll update you guys on that too on how i did that hey besties so i just showed you guys that table that i purchased for my living room and i think it looks so beautiful painted now in white i am going to be sanding the sides of the table just because i think it will look better um but i'm gonna have to do that by hand i'll probably do that tomorrow and i'll stain it and once i'm done with it i'll show you guys how it looks i'll update you guys later on but i want to show you guys what else i picked up i picked up these plates right here Sorry, my hands are still full of paint. I tried washing them, but it's not coming out. Um, I just thought these were so, so pretty for fall. Look at how beautiful they are. They have like little leaves on the sides. So I picked out four of these. They were a dollar each. And then I also picked up this milk glass piece, you guys. I thought <laughs> this is so beautiful. I already have two of these. Um, and since um, Laura told me that they are stackable, I've been keeping an eye out at the um, thrift store every time I go and I finally found one. And this one was really, really ugly. Um, it had like some kind of, I don't know if it was like, I don't know, like some kind of glue or tape. I don't know what it was, but I had to take it off and wash it really good, but it cleaned up so well. I think this was a dollar. $1.50. I took off the tag. I can't remember, but I think it was like about a dollar. The table was 20. The plates were a dollar each. And I think this was a dollar as well. But I'm really excited that I found one of these and I'm really happy with the table, you guys. I'm so, so happy with the table. I had been looking for a table where I can store things because I don't really have a, um, like a spare closet where I can put things. And I have a lot of DVDs that I want to put in there and just like random stuff. But I'm so, so happy that I found it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, besties.